Hi guys, so some of you want more outfit of the days. I don't know why, you know, now that I'm a housewife, I don't have to like wear professional outfits a lot, but I am a classic dresser and I think a lot of my outfits may help you for your weekend looks, after work looks, or if you can go into work casually, but wanna look pulled together. All right, so my hair is still in these twists. They're getting a little frizzy, um, a little rough, but I kind of like it. It gives me like this boho vibe. So I like when my twists get a little frizzy. I'll probably take them out in about a week or so. I need to order some more hair from Amazon. So I'll probably just wash it again and redo the front and then wait till I get my hair in from Amazon because I've been doing flat irons on my hair and it has taken its toll. So I'm giving myself a little break for flat irons. And then when I start traveling, God willing, over the summer, I'll do some box braids probably. So the top is from H&M. I think every woman needs basic tops in their wardrobe and you can never have enough of these. I just got another brown one and necklace is another item that i got when i was in greece when i was in athens i love delicate jewelry so if you have any jewelry suggestions for simple minimal jewelry let me know i got these little studs they're gold from dubai i'm wearing my louis vuitton bracelet that i got in greece as well for my anniversary and the pants are from H&M. Now, I love sweatpants like this. If you wanna look more pulled together, more sophisticated, uh, get wide leg sweatpants. They flatter, curvier women. Um, they look nice on our shape. Sometimes the normal sweatpants can make you look kind of sloppy. And you know, that's the plight of being a bigger woman. Uh, a lot of clothing just doesn't look good on our body type. And so we do have to work with that. But wide leg sweats, they look great. Sometimes I wear these with heels and I dress it up a bit. And so I think this is a nice casual look, but I still like to look pulled together. So this is what I'm wearing today. Um, I have my Yeezys on. And this is the look, and let me show you the bag I'm gonna carry. So I'm gonna carry this Marc Jacobs tote bag. I absolutely love this. I hunted everywhere for this bag because when I wanted to get mine, I couldn't find black anywhere. And I finally found black, and let me be honest, I've probably only worn this bag like three times, but I do love it. And today I'm gonna carry my laptop cause I'm gonna edit and do some business things. So yeah, I'm gonna carry this bag. So I'm probably gonna throw a little shirt on around my waist because I like to be a bit more covered um, and I might get cold. It's really cold in the malls cause everything's in the malls like grocery stores, nail shops, Everywhere you go, you're gonna be in a mall most of the time. Instead of the shirt, I might do this light shacket that I got from H&M. I wear it all of the time and I can tie it around my waist just in case I get cool when I'm in the mall. And it's just a great staple piece. It's a neutral. I wear it with everything. I so love it. So I can wrap this around my waist and then I could also put it on if I get chilly. So this is my look for today. Heard the Swedish meatballs at Ikea are really good. I've been here almost five years now and I've never tried them, but they really are good. I think my husband would like them. 
so yeah, they're really good. Tilbury today and pick up the setting spray or like viral setting spray because once I put my mask on my makeup is done let me finish eating up then I'm gonna go around Ikea because I want to create a vanity space for one of my bedrooms and then I'm gonna stop by Charlotte Tilbury and then H&M because I'm looking for a bodysuit that I saw so let me finish up here Okay, you guys, I left Ikea. They didn't have the desk that I wanted. They had the bigger version, which you guys will see now. So I'm gonna go online and talk to my husband because I don't think I've completely told him about this plan to set up a vanity in one of the bedrooms, but I know he'll be down for it, you know. So now I'm gonna go to H&M I'm gonna go to Charlotte Tilbury and then I'm gonna call my husband because he's off now and I need to see what he wants to do for dinner later. looking for some bodysuits to wear under my shirts this summer and um, there was one bodysuit that I wanted and I saw it but it's kind of thin and see-through so I was like nah so I think I'm gonna pick up this one because I love anything animal print it's a neutral for me and see how it looks under my button-down shirt um, the extra large looks really big but I don't want it to be tight because I don't want it to cling to any imperfections. So I'm going to I'm going to go with the extra large. And if it's too big, then I'll come back and return it. It is 7 p.m. I really need to get out of here. So let me go purchase this last item and then I'm going to get out of here. So I came to close out the vlog. Um, there was something I wanted to talk to you guys about, but I'm just going to talk to you about it in my next video. Um, I just want to talk about something that I see is happening to a lot of us here on YouTube and online because the online world could be a very dark space but because of the background noise I think I'm just going to talk to you in my next video because um, I'm probably going to do a little haul to show y'all just some little things that I picked up right now I'm going to edit some videos get some work done and as you can see here those are <laughs> Those are all my packages from today. So I'm just gonna edit for a little while and then I'm going to head back home. All right, so I hope you enjoyed today's video. Just a little something. Um, I have some like real videos coming, but it just takes a while to edit. Y'all know how it is. So I will see you next time. Bye guys.